Right, so I'm on this bike ride and we're going to go visit some uh, buildings and we're going to check out the quality of the window cleaning on some of these buildings. Now I know three of them that we're going to visit first is done by Waterford Pole. Now never in my life have I seen, witnessed perfect results with window cleaners solely using Waterford Pole for these jobs. Now these jobs that we're going to go to will be done where if you could use a squeegee well, far easier and simpler, I would say, with the squeegees. Uh, but uh, we know most window cleaners aren't that great with squeegees. So let's go visit these buildings and let's see the telltale signs of not only Waterford Pole um, failures, but also window cleaning with the squeegee failures. Let's have a look. Okay, so we're gonna look at these uh, buildings here. They're just very small buildings, little small units. And uh, what I noticed when I came here the other day on the bike, uh, the windows were clean, waterproof pole. How do I know that? Well, the frames are very clean. But unfortunately, the glass isn't so. So let's just eyeball these windows just here. And this, I mean, they look great from far distance. Oh, straight away, what, what can we see? Hopefully on this, uh, probably can't see on here. We see a nice trail coming down. I can see it really well with my eyesight, but I don't know if you can see it very well here. Right, we've got a big leak here. Uh, frames look pretty good. But where was these spotting issues that I noticed? Probably can't see any of it on that lot. This window's full of little spots. Full, everywhere. Up here. On the camera, I don't know if it's coming out. Spots. Spots everywhere. Spotting. Let's go and have a look over here. I noticed that the door here was done with a squeegee. And... The, uh, the squeegee wasn't done very well. Uh, look, look at this uh, squeegee technique up here. Look at the state of that. Look at that. What a nightmare job. Can you see all the streaks? I you can see on the camera, that's the only thing. Full of streaks. Pull down streaks. Let's have a look at the Detailing. Where did I see all that leaking? Ah, look. Detailing. Everywhere. Detail. Look at the edge. So that's done traditionally. Um, and over here. Detailing. This is all stuff that is common on. Uh, average day-to-day -day window cleaning and uh, let's go over here what we got here oh maybe you can't see I can see very clearly in my eyes look at all that residue that's from Waterford Pole Waterford Pole spotting everywhere everywhere right let's go and have a look at some other jobs Right, okay, so we're going to go to another building. Just a very small little unit. Uh, I think these windows are done with water-fed pole. Now, from here, they look very good. It doesn't look like they've been done recently, but this window is full of spots. Full of them. That's spots from the um, waterfed pole. Uh, you can't really see very good up there. Here, spots everywhere. This is waterfed pole on this job and you can see it's waterfed pole because you can see how bad the frames are. He's obviously washed the frames and 
hasn't done a, a particularly great job. So even on this job, the actual frames look crap. Uh, no detailing on here because they're done with the waterfed pole. So really there's detailing everywhere on this pane of glass. And all over here, let's go and have another look, another job. So these windows here haven't been cleaned in a while. And what happened was uh, the window cleaner was so bad here, uh, he got the sack. So you can see he didn't do a very good job with the windows here. But this is probably the worst uh, job that I've witnessed where I live. But uh, yeah, um, he was like really bad at his job. Okay, so this next building is it's massive and it's a job that I've always wanted to do, but it's done by a national firm. It's the biggest window cleaning firm for commercial window cleaners. Now, I haven't been here for oh, a couple of years, but I just remember one thing, detailing everywhere, straight pulls everywhere, drips everywhere. So I haven't been here for a long time, but I mean, that building, that'll be a, just squeegee all that, I'll, that'll be a dream for me because, um, uh, down here, guys, this way, uh, because, um, Oh, I like to squeegee. So, let's have a look. Oh, they're in a really bad state actually. So these haven't been cleaned in a long time. But what we can look for is the telltale signs of where the windows were cleaned. Like the detailing, because the detailing will always be there. Um, I mean, if, actually it's not a job that I would want to do unless it was on a regular basis. They're, they're in really bad condition. <laughs> Now, where's all this detail? I remember the detailing on these windows um, from years ago. But as you can see, they, there's cobwebs everywhere. So they might not have been done in many years. So if this was a, a, like a, a regular two to three uh, month job, you know, I'd love to do this job. But as you can see, it's so bad. Um, hasn't been done in such a long time. Massive firm this is uh, who owns this building big bank I uh, we, we've got some detailing um, but it looks like these haven't been done in such a long time here's the telltale signs of where the squeegee left its mark there we go um, yeah filthy absolute filth but if it was, as I said, regular done, um, you know, I'd, I'd love to do this job. Uh, because it's, you know, pole, blade, blade. And what I'll do personally would be to pole all the tops, maybe do it in sections. So do that section there, squeegee, squeegee, hand squeegee, then pole here. So I wouldn't be working, this is what I wouldn't do, what other window cleaners on YouTube have said in the past is they'll do that one there, then that one and that one, but then you'll get the drip. So what I'll do is squeegee over here with the pole and then blade, 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 blade. Um, that would probably be the way I'll do it. And I'll just go section by section and we got upstairs, then we got another upstairs again. Um, so I can't really fault the window cleaner here because he hasn't been in such a long time, uh, but uh, there, there is, Detailing where the squeegee has been left for many years. Detailing that just never gets cleaned up. So uh, this is done by the biggest window cleaning firm in the UK. And uh, I haven't met any of them who use two hands. Um, they all use one hand. Window cleaning, eh? What fun. Go over there. Okay, so we'll go to um, one or two more buildings. Now, it's not all criticism. This is not a job that I do, but I've always noticed that the window cleaner does this job, this way, the window cleaner does this job, he's, uh, he's on the case. He knows how to clean windows very well. So, 
I don't want to go too uh, close to the reception, but we'll eyeball these windows here. And let's look at these two here. Maybe we'll go over there afterwards. And uh, what we've got here is good quality window cleaning. I know that they don't use liquidators, but um, the quality, I mean, it's a bit detailed on the other side of the window, but the quality is very good. Detailing on the other side of the glass, but we're looking at this side. Can you see the detailing? There you go, see that? That's on the inside. So we know he doesn't use liquidators. Um, we've got a few cobwebs in the corner, but we'll let that step. A little bit of detailing here, right in the corner. But overall, that's a good quality clean for um, the average window cleaner. We'll go over to one more job over here and then we'll call this video quits. Okay, so uh, this is be the last job. Uh, it looks like someone's still in here. So we'll just go here. Um, this has got tint on it, but I reckon the same window cleaner cleans these windows than the one we've just been to, uh, because there's hardly any detailing on show. Pretty good quality window cleaning. Um, he does it thoroughly, but as I, as I say, I know he doesn't use the liquidators, um, but, uh, Let's have a look at reception because it's always good to look at the uh, actual reception because that's where the window cleaning will be done at the best because this is where people obviously come through. And what I like to do, how I check the windows is I go at the corners, make sure that the, uh, the telltale signs, these the edges, top corners, um, that's good quality. But they haven't been done in a while because we've got some speckles from the weather few cobwebs but overall that's good quality window cleaning I know he's done with a squeegee and the um, yeah pretty good yeah so I know he's done with a squeegee um, but however long it took him to do this I'll get it done in at least half the time because I use the right tool for the right job right size tool zero detailing Minimum moves, this is a regular clean. And uh, next level window cleaning will obviously be uh, two to three times quicker. That's my video over. Thanks for watching. Ta da. <clears throat> okay, so I did say it was the end, uh, but what I wanted to show just before we finish the video is a job that I do. Um, this hasn't been done in two weeks door is the best place to check we've got a few fingerprints here let's look at the quality there's zero detailing everywhere zero and i don't use the cloth zero that is a bit dirt dust that exists is two weeks but zero let's check another job all right look at just the edge here done on with a 22 inch zero zero detailing uh, so that for me is the minimum requirement um, that I expect from myself and the tools that I use uh, but obviously I don't do this job here this is uh, another big uh, job run by the um, biggest firm window cleaning firm oh I'll tell you what it's while we're here Let's just check that out. Uh, good, uh, yeah, here we go. This is put the quality here. The, uh, the detailing up here. That's the biggest window cleaning firm. This is Tesco, obviously, so big, big business. They use big window cleaning companies that have very low quality when they're cleaning standards so i hope you enjoyed the video um i'm going now going home and enjoy the rest of my evening <laughs>